Everybody and welcome back to Evolution of McRae on the BFG 13 and today we're on stage 3 and 4 we want to repair these for some reason it's double clicking everything oh we've got three stages today what do you know let's just have a look at the brakes brakes seem to be fine and we're done there Here we go. One, I'm wrong. Now we've got to start here. Oi! So yeah, you'll sometimes get the, the rallies where they have like seven stages instead of six. Sometimes you'll get them like this where You'll do uh, five stages, and then uh, so you'll do. Oops. Uh, you'll do something like two stages, first two stages, and then instead of doing another two stages, you'll end up doing three stages, and then just one stage on its own, and then oh, you'll see what I mean. You'll probably think about that. It's a bit ridiculous why they put three. Mate, you do three stages in one. Three and a bit seconds, that's good. But, believe me, I've asked myself the same question for years. I wonder why they've done it. I've not been questioning it. It's not been on my mind for 10 to 12 years, but it's definitely been there somewhere in my mind. Ooh, hit the back of the car hard. As you can tell, I'm actually pushing hard with this car about now. I shouldn't really be pushing too hard. Hey, oops! I couldn't see the sign. Change down the gear by accident. Oh, that's better. Well, like I said in the previous episode, uh, Greece is a quick rally, so it's no surprise when you see some of the stages. Whoa, like this. Jesus. Whoa, my God. Oh, my. Oh, a power slider, not till the finish. Wow. Pretty difficult track, that one. Not gonna lie. Sorry, stage. Set the record! Hooray! We're even more further away. 25 seconds now. Woohoo! Okie dokie. Like I said, we got three stages to do before we get to the next service area, so we've got to make sure that these last. I think there's a night stage in this rally. I'm not too sure, and if it's not here, it's in the next rally, which is Monte Carlo. And no, it's not on time. It's actually on snow and ice, because it's set in the mountains. Because it's a rally, duh. It's not like F1. Although I wish it was like F1, sort of. A silly thing to say, but I think rally cars are doing well on the Monaco circuit. The Grand Prix circuit, that is. They're thinking, yeah, bloody mental. No, no F1 car go around there. Sorry, no rally car could go around an F1 circuit. Not true, ex not exactly true. Uh, Jim Car- oh, what's it called, uh, Ken Block, who is in the, uh, Jim Carner in America, he, um, did something with Lewis Hamilton recently where he was in a rally car and he raced Lewis Hamilton around this little tight track. Now yeah, we gained three seconds up on McRae there. And, um, what had happened was him and Hamilton had a race and it was quite interesting, I believe. Uh, I remember hearing about it on the news, but it was quite interesting. 
Oi, into the wall. Kind of forgot that actually tricks me a lot. Not joking, it actually does. I, I go off on that corner a lot. So that's something I need. one stage I need one more stage I need to whoa, need to practice. I'm not exactly used to the uh, box up not box. I was gonna say box all and I meant Subaru. I'm not exact. Uh, I'm not exactly fully used to the Subaru of uh, this game. I'm more used to the Audi Quattro of this game because the Audi Quattro is so fast and uh, it's got so much power to it. I did the uh, Monte Carlo Rally um, in the uh, Audi Quattro, and I remember I was trying to win it, and I only just won it by a couple of seconds because I, I, I pulled up like a 30-second lead. And the last two, last two the stages that I had, I like really messed up, and I, I had like a wrecked car. And on the last, last stage, I had um, my front left tire was absolutely knackered because I would smashed the front of the car in. And uh, what this caused was it caused second, McCray, uh, second place, which was Colin McRae at that time, um, and third place, I think, which was the Mitsubishi of Kevin Backlund, or whoever the other Mitsubishi driver is. Caused him to catch up. Oh, this is fun. Yeah, that bit catches you out a lot, trust me. Unless you know where you're going with that corner. This corner never catches me out. This one's a long right hander, so very long right hander at that. And this one's a quick right uh, left if you can do it. Near enough. It's close enough. Okay, and 15 seconds clear, and we're now nearly a full minute up onto the fifth stage, which is second to last, well, third to last, more like. Next stage is the second to last, and then you got the last stage, which is a super special. It's the first we've ever seen on a rally, so buckle, buckle up. It's going to be a bumpy ride, this one. Not this stage, I mean, when you get to the... Uh, it's going to be a very fast one, so make sure you're watching. Just saying. You might want to watch it. So stick around for episode 6 of Evolution Pro. Okay. Can't believe we're, that. we're actually that far. I know there have been more like um, uh, episodes at the moment, uh, rather than anything else. Um, but a friend of mine has given me a very useful suggestion. And he suggested that I'm going to do um, in seasons. Now what this means is that... Evolution Crow, it'll still be running like episode 20 or whatever. Um, but if I'm on a different game, uh, it'll be like season 2, season 3. So at the moment, this is season 1. And when we finish this game, we'll move on to season 2, which will be because it's the second game. We'll, fi we'll finish the uh, the uh, Evolution of Crow off on uh, season 5 when we get to it. But it'll be like, it'll be in a playlist called season 5. So. We'll still be at, we'll still be in numbers, so probably episode 40 or 50, maybe, or 60 even. Um, but, uh, if you're wondering what... If you're wondering what's... Um, unfortunately, I can't tell you what's actually happened right now. Might have just heard a bit bashing there, but uh, yeah, my controller got stuck. Uh, the X button got stuck for some reason, man. So I was accelerating around the corners that I shouldn't have done. I probably actually had to do that just then. I never usually do that. Uh, let's see. Oh, this one. I remember this track well. Ah, yes. There's a corner here. A couple. Of, I think this one. I don't. Yeah, it, no, no, it's this bit here. This one throws you off. If you go wide here, prepare to have health, because your car goes head over heels. I ain't joking, neither. Your car goes head over heels. Oh, there you go. Now, it's not, I can't, uh, I hope I don't catch the front end on that stuff. We're going for the finish. Slide it in. 14 and a half seconds. It's good enough for me. And actually nearly... Yeah, we are. We're exactly what we're over a minute ahead of McRae, which is brilliant. 
So I'm crazy nearly a minute ahead of second place. It's three seconds that separate third and fourth. And 27 between fifth, fourth and fifth. 10 seconds between fifth and sixth place on two four teammates. Then it's both Toyotas rounding out the top eight. In terms of GP2, our Magnus stops out the timesheets. He's only he's a, nearly a minute behind uh, Diddy AR rule, but he's still ninth and he's still first in terms of GP2. And John Cruz, I think, uh, John Cruz, sounds like Tom Cruise, but with John, I think that's how you pronounce it. John Cruz, I guess so, or Cruz, I don't know. <laughs> uh, put it in the comments, I however you say it. Uh, but yeah, he's like nearly, how many minutes behind is he? He's like over, he's five minutes, over five minutes behind me. Holy crap. Oh, McCray. I'm going to quickly save. Just show him there. There we go, and that's it, been a very, I guess, very quick episode 5, I think this is now, we're on, been a very quick episode 5, obviously I got a few problems on my controller just there, but, uh, oh, this said there'll be effects, and uh, apologies for if you heard the double clicking sound in the menu, so it goes, dum, dum, you'll hear it, if you hear it twice, uh, which I'm guessing you probably will, um, then uh, I'm apologies about that. I promise I'll try and get it fixed ASAP. I'm, I am working on trying to get it fixed. Hopefully I can get it fixed for the next episode or... Well, for the next rally because I think I might have to put up with it until next rally. Um, but if not, I'll see what I can do and I'll try and fix it as best as I can. But until then, uh, I've been the BPG13. This has been episode 5 of Evolution McCray. And I'll see you guys in the next episode.